Hello, Bosley readers, and welcome to our simulation of Bosnia Herzegovina versus the Republic of Ireland in our crucial Euro 2016 playoff that's taking place on Friday night. You'll notice straight away that Bosnia aren't in FIFA 16, so we've had to improvise. You may have seen Bobby Zamora appearing on the bench for Bosnia. Don't expect to see that in Zenit on Friday night. Um, what we've done is we've taken all the Bosnian players we could find and put them on Brighton and Hove Albion because the names are kind of similar and so are the colours. Uh, we've also put out an Irish team that we think Martin O'Neill is going to try and field in the hopes of making this as authentic as possible. So um, Seamus Coleman's ready for it. Uh, we hope you are. Obviously, um, Jefferson Robertsford from the States, for some reason, is going to be in charge of this uh, UEFA qualifier, which is a bit of a strange call. Hopefully he has a good game because I think we're going to need a favour or two from him. Um, so we're getting ready to kick off, and there we go. Uh, Bosnia, not Brighton, are playing from left to right, and they have gotten us underway. So seventh minute is the first piece of action. You can see a dangerous ball over the top, well dealt with by Seamus Coleman, until he decides to completely lose the plot. And after a quick one-two with Darren Randolph, he lobs a hospital pass in the general direction of Richard Kyo, who doesn't exactly deal with it well, and bang. Bosnia are 1-0 up, but no, the referee... Jefferson Robertford has done us a favour there and called it back for an apparent foul. Now, Ireland are starting to have a bit of fun. We're half an hour in. Uh, you can see us spreading the ball around here. This is some beautiful play. Ginger James McLean on the ball. He's looking to go back inside. If we can get this type of passing going in Zenitia, I think we'd be going a long way to securing a victory. You can see Robbie Keane's dropping deep. He's getting involved. Everybody's having a good time. It's not really realistic from FIFA's point of view, but then here comes the realism. The, bo the chance is just completely wasted. Bosnia now putting the pressure on. It's uh, a nicely worked move. This is their best chance, and thankfully it falls to their right back, who has had an absolute nightmare there. Um, you can see Seamus Coleman already is rattled, so uh, that's worrying. Hopefully it doesn't actually play like that in the real game. Richard Kyo starts us off. Ireland now trying to get a goal before halftime. Glenn Whelan with an absolute worldy. That is classic Glenn. He finds Jeff Hendrick, who knocks it down to Robbie Keane. And again, Ireland really starting to express themselves in the middle. I'm hoping this is how it goes in the real game. Robbie Keane out wide, where he always finds himself, and delivers an amazing ball in. And look at the aerial prowess from Wes Hoolan. Now, he doesn't score, but, uh, but that's a good statement of intent. And that brings us up to half time. We're jumping straight back into the action, though, because the second half is underway. Now, you see Wes Hoolan and Robbie Keane getting us started. Unfortunately, this second half didn't have many highlights. You'll see here we jump to the 60th minute and Bosnia are starting to press. Mirlan Pjanic is the star man and he is going to have to try better than that if Bosnia are going to beat us on Friday night. Again, we're jumping to the 89th minute and just look at these scenes. An absolutely shocking tackle from Aidan McGeady. Right before the 90th minute hits, he, uh, he's just lost the plot there. I mean, he's not starting for Ireland. He's not playing for Everton. That's frustration from Aidan McGeady bearing fruit and unfortunately I mean he's, he's put us in an awful hole here and now he thinks he's a hard man he's starting on all the Bosnia players that's that's uncalled for from, from Aidan McGeady you'll see the replay look at the look on his face that is a meticulous challenge nobody wants to see that from the boys in green and also now Ireland have to defend in the 90th minute can we hang on yes we can thankfully um, Mark Wilson gets the clearance there I think it was and that is full time Ireland nil Bosnia nil we will take that going into the second leg.